I'm slicing two red onions for my sweet potato and garlic fries. I'm gonna layer them with lots and lots of different flavors. So we're gonna start by adding about three tablespoons or so of olive oil. You wanna heat up your pan. We're gonna add all of the onion slices right in here. I really like the red onions for this. We're gonna add a little salt, a little pepper. We're also gonna add a little bit of balsamic vinegar. So about a tablespoon or so. And the balsamic vinegar helps caramelize the onions and gives them a wonderful, a sweet, rich, elegant kind of flavor. The caramelized onions are done and they're cooled. I've already cut two of my sweet potatoes and I'm on my last one. Cut them in half and cut the halves into thirds and cut them again, just like that. So you get nice, big, thick cut fries. Let's make the fried batter. We're gonna do two and a half cups of flour. The batter helps create this nice crust on the outside of the potatoes. Then we're gonna need a half a teaspoon of baking soda. There we go, and dump that right in there. And then also a half a teaspoon of baking powder. And the reason that you want this is because the baking powder and baking soda combo allows the batter to rise and keeps it nice and tender. We get a light, flaky crust and nice and crunchy too. We're gonna add a little salt and we need about two and a half cups of water. We're gonna whisk this all together and your batter is done. I take the potatoes and I put them immediately right in here. I take one of my spiders, toss all the potatoes so they all get coated in the batter. So now that we've got all the potatoes that are coated, with my thermometer, you can see that the vegetable oil is at 375, which is exactly what you want it to be to get that nice crunchy crust. Put a few potatoes into the oil. We go and we'll allow those to fry up. So what we want to do now, smash and peel three garlic cloves. There we go. So you just want to peel them. We're going to actually chop them up so that they infuse into the butter very, very quickly. Now we're going to add some time. I wanted to add a little bit of sort of a lemony fresh herb into the butter. And chop it up. Give it a quick little whirl and we're gonna put it on low heat just so the garlic and the thyme can infuse in the butter and then we'll pour it over the hot french fries. They're hot. I take the garlic and thyme butter, and I just pour it right over the top. Add a few red onions here and there. Then I sprinkle some of the Fontina cheese right over the top. Does it not look beautiful? I'm gonna just take one. Mm. Light crust creamy and slightly sweet on the inside. You got a little red onion and some cheese. This is one yummy food truck french fry. <laughs>